Ooh, what's happening guys right so today we've got some screen printing to do then you guessed it some more 3d embroidery and then probably some layouts basically it's going to be a catch-up day because of ending so late on the last one which i think was about two o'clock in the morning anyway so i'm mike this is my t-shirt printers let's do this right so the first thing we're going to do is get on with some screen printing which is these boxes right here Yep, there's a lot of them. So I'm gonna grab some shirts once you're done with the screen printing. Then we're gonna get on with some embroidery. The 3D cap embroidery. And then see how the day goes if we can do some layouts later. But first things first, grab the shirts, get the press ready, film as much as I can, because I've got to plow through these today. Let's do this. Ink spatulas, but I don't want to use them because I really like them. I don't want to get them dirty. Stupid, I know. So it's really cold down here. Yeah. Just gonna warm up the palette a bit. Really, really sticky. So that's already. Do you know why we tack the boards? Well, we tack the boards so that when you put the t-shirts on, if you're printing multiple colors, it, the shirt won't move. So you're basically gluing the shirts to the board every time we put it on with the glue. That's why you do it. And we'll grab some shirts. So as per normal, what we're gonna do is put the strike off first, which is when we just do a hit of the ink so that we make sure our printer's printing correctly. Okay, so what I'm doing, I'm just finishing off warming up the boards. Because it's so cold in here, the, the ink's really cold, so I've got to warm, those, warm the ink up and warm the boards up, then we just get that really nice, smooth, smooth print. So, there it goes, one more loop, and I'm going to start printing. It's all looking good. printing done, time to go upstairs and get some of that embroidery work done. Okay, onto the embroidery. So, this book here. So that's, that's the logo that we digitized there. It's ready to go into the cap. Cool logo. So the first thing I'm going to do is just sort out the caps into the different colors so that I know what foam or different colored 3D foam is going to go underneath each one so I can work with all the quantities of those. So let me sort out the caps, and then I can cut out all the foam. Caps are sorted. What a cool selection of caps here. We've got ones from like Floral Prints, Yupon Premium Caps. Those are really nice. These are our favorite caps. The suede caps, the front of suede. Not the whole cap. We've got some of this denim. The denim and suede. Some two-tone caps. It's a really cool selection of caps here. Anyway. So it's time to start cutting that foam out. So we've got the design loaded on this machine here. Just gotta get some caps hoops and get this job going. Cap hoop. Break the table. <laughs> So 
logo has come out super sharp. Really looking good. Look at that. Slow mo. This is what happens when you're starting to make videos while embroidering. Ran out of thread. Number nine, threads run out. So I've got to re thread that. A new black thread. But here's a handy tip. Instead of using Right. Instead of using one of these funny whoop, wiry, I don't even know what you call this, but this, one of these wiry things, you've got to try to feed down here and all that stuff. All you got to do, get your thread, put your cone on there, put your thread into the tube, and then just get your compressed air. Shoots out, so none of that wire stuff anymore. Just so we just need to check where we are, tickle the ones we've done. So, we'll move on to these two next. So we do a quick color change and carry on. Shop owners sweep their own doors. How's the color of this one? That is super, super bright. She looks quite cool. Hmm. Okay, so that's going to be the last cap I'm going to do for today. Good boy, I am shattered. It's just been a long day of screen printing and embroidery. I'll finish this job up tomorrow so we can get it out off to France. So I'm still gonna go home anyway and do a just a little bit more on this class I'm gonna be taking on screen separations. If you are interested, I'll leave a link below so you can find out more details on it. I'm doing a lot with my hands. Anyway, subscribe, hit that like button, and I'll catch you on the next one. I can't reach, too tired.